Alright, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21 got a lot of news for you guys, man. Look, we got Mike Wong talking about the green light jump shot glitch. We got your boy OVO Phantoms. He's talking about um, a, a, an alleged scammer in the community. And we got to say allegedly because we don't know anything for sure and we haven't gotten to the bottom of it. And last but not least, we got NBA 2K Lab breaking down jump shots, the green window, and how different ratings affect the green window. So make sure you, you like the video. If you like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content. We're bringing the 2K heat every day of the week. And uh, like I said, if we can get this video over a thousand likes, man, I would be greatly appreciated. YouTube directly links likes to views and recommend it so if you don't like the video nobody's gonna see it man and i got a banger gameplay for y'all right here so hold on to your seat and wait one second till we get back i messed that all the way up but i ain't doing it over Lito! If you make it to C25, that's OG status. I was told you could be anything, just don't be average. Down bad, flat pipes, that shit made me upset. Start hustling non-stop, don't plan on breaking that habit. Alright, man, so y'all already know what it is, man. We're gonna get through this as quickly as possible, bro. Look, Mike Wong, young Mike Wong, he was talking about the patch notes or what have you, and somebody brought this up right here. The green light jump shot glitch when somebody shoots a green you get kicked out of the game like i know you all have experienced it i know you've seen it me and man man was doing it like damn did i just get banned and to that mike just uh he responded and just said our engineers think that they've pinpointed the issue and are working on a fix can you guys tell me if you changed your shot feedback setting if you did if you did can you set it up uh can you set it back to uh, user only and let me know if this helps so i don't know what it is about the whole shot feedback settings i don't even know why people want to turn them off and stuff like that with well, the shot feedback settings is just this you can turn your shot feedback on and everybody can see whether you greened it or not and you can see your shot feedback or you can turn it off and nobody will know and that's what i'm saying like i, I feel like that's just something that's kind of it's just kind of weird like why why are people turning it off why don't they I, I don't get it man i don't know why you turn it off or whatever i just let the game be how it is look you can see me using the shot meter and uh all that good stuff you can see it pop up all that so i really don't care i guess i don't know like if you're cheating or something i guess you would want to uh turn it off so people can't see if you greened every time or if you just close every time or whatever like that but look bro i'm i, I use the shot stick you can see me pull it up shoot it and all of that stuff i want you to see that the green is on the way i want you to see that the ball going there so i ain't turning mine off so i've not experienced getting kicked out but i've definitely seen some people that reset their joints uh get kicked out i don't know if that's the reason but hey that's what mike is asking right now so uh we gonna find out about that on to our next news story man we got your boy ovo phantom man he put out an excellent video on yesterday talking about pretty much he's just talking about the fellow uh from the from the 2k community what was his name rax or something like that he was uh, the benefactor of a lot of streamers being able to bet big money against each other and he said nobody got scammed off of that but the thing that people are saying they got scammed off of was like a a double your money type thing where you send him some money and then uh you know you get you double your money a week later it's like an investment like you give him some money he'll go invest it real quick and then uh you know a couple weeks later you'll get it right back and uh, I'm like, yeah, you know, I, I don't I, I don't get why people go for stuff like that. I mean, I've seen it a lot before. I've seen it like a lot before in real life. It's like an inverted pyramid scheme or something like that, uh, where, you know, you get the, you, you put it in the money the first time, you get it back. You put it in the second time, you get it back. And the third time, or when you put in a lot of money, the person go ghost on you and you just don't hear from them anymore. Um, rarely if ever again and so like like and it's the same thing with the thing where it's like you put in a hundred dollars you get yours back like you put in a hundred dollars you get 800 back once everybody keeps putting in and it'll keep going if everybody keeps putting in but the people that get screwed are the last people that that come in normally that's how those things happen so hey stay away from stuff like that i don't know how true it is i'm just letting you know phantoms did an awesome video go over there check that video out i don't know if he did it or not i really don't much care because i don't get involved in stuff like that i'm just saying you know like if something seems to be too good to be true it probably is man and last but not least what we got on the burner man nba 2k lab did an awesome video man on the uh the making of shots 
and uh, your three point rating and how it impacts it. And then I think one of the things you need to go watch the entire video, and all the videos to the links will be down in the description. They're saying to shoot consistently, you're gonna need about an 86 uh, three point rating. Uh, I mean, that's true, I guess, if you're using the button, but in this video right here, you're seeing me hit, you know, pretty much every shot I'm taking, and it's green. And uh, I'm using the stick, and I've got an 85 three-point rating. Now we're not talking. We, they didn't say anything about what happens, you know, when you uh, once you get once you get what once you get a uh, dimer and floor general and all that stuff. So if dimer, floor general, and all that kick into it, my my three-point rating is definitely over. Well, I'm even green in layups, man. My three-point rating is definitely over that 86 range. But you have to go watch that video because they're not wrong about many things, man. But I know that. Maybe me using the stick gives me a boost and puts me over that, um, gives me a little boost and it puts me over that little 80 range or what have you, man. But I, I just don't know how many people are really out here stroking it like I'm stroking it, even with a pure stretch. I don't even got all my badges yet. Like, I think all I got is what I got on right now. I think I got on catch and shoot, range extender, and dead eye, something like that. And I just went off in that video. <laughs> It is what it is though, man, but people I just don't understand this preconceived notion where people feel like yeah seven for seven five for five from three man 19 points I just don't understand this whole preconceived notion where people feel like they can just leave people open in this game I think that it's, it's just something that we just got to get rid of people got to get out of their heads and all of this stuff man I can just leave him open. He's not gonna be able to shoot even though it says he's a stretch five He's still not gonna be able to shoot man Like I said if some too, if some seems too good to be true it normally is and thinking of stretch being can't shoot that's too good to be true so i mean I, I would think that's something that i wouldn't even bother with but like i said man links to all these stories are down in the description i want you guys to go check it out give those guys a thumbs up if you made it this far give me a jump start down in the comment section and also man i want you like the video man i dropped 19 bro come on 19 five for five who's doing that I dare you. Show me another big man that's doing that. That's all I want y'all to do. Should I have made that be a video by itself? I probably should have, but that happens so often now that it's not even a big deal to me. Like, I mean, I'm dropping buckets unless I got people out there trying to troll or something. I mean, this is like 2K19, so they can just jump into you. You can't take shots in this game. It's not like 2K18 and 2K20 where you got punished for playing lazy defense. I can still hit the shot. It's like until I get a uh, dead eye on Hall of Fame, you can just jump at somebody from the, you can be at the free throw line and I can be at the hash and you can just jump at me and it's gonna make the thing be unbearably small. But if you don't guard me, man, this thing is cash every time. Anyway, like the video. Let's get this video to 1,000 likes in the first 24 hours, man. I really appreciate that. Let's get it over 10,000 views. People need to see the best stretch big in the game. Because everybody else talking about they're good. They're not hitting like this, especially with the stretch five. They might got a stretch four with like a 95 three ball, but a stretch a stretch five with an 85 three ain't nobody doing this, man. It is what it is, man. And wait till I get all the badges unlocked. I'll release this build if you guys just get this video over 10,000 views and over 1,000 likes in the first 24 hours. Do that for me and I got you. Anyway, I'm going to holler at y'all next time, man. I appreciate y'all watching. And like I said, you made it this far. Like the video. Subscribe for more Daily 2K content. Give me a gem stars down low. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time. Till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Town. God speak. Commence. It don't make cash and it don't make sense Cause we can't pay rent with no one's opinion So in that sense, I never value your two cents Hey, darn, please leave that bullshit you speak at the barn Cause I ain't buying I'm only 5'8", that's fine, nigga I can give a hard transplant to a giant I ain't lying, God speak We good